All right, these back people. So on the next call here, we got a uh, no cooling call, about 90 some degrees in the house, they say. So on this one here, though, I want to check out my left fan right here. So this is an AC around my neck. I've been using this maybe about the last week. I haven't taken on the troubleshooting call, but I like cut my grass and been walking, you know, walking around the outlet mall, the park, department stores and stuff like that. Man, I do not want to take this thing off. And this is not a sponsored video. I pay hard, my hard-earned cash for this. I will leave a link in the description below if anybody do want to purchase this. I will get a little small percentage if you want to purchase because these things are not cheap. They run around three or $400, but man, these things are nice. I don't have it on now. Let me see, I'm gonna turn it on. I keep it in AI mode. So this will be my first car though, first troubleshooting car that I'm gonna I'm run it on. Man, I love this thing. This is the Ares Air 2, Renvo Air, Air 2, Air 3. It's the most updated one. This thing has AI technology in it. You just put it around your neck and forget about it. It, it takes like your, your blood pressure, or, or uh, your heart monitor, uh, play music on it, Bluetooth. Ain't got the best speaker in the world for music, but you can, you know, listen to your favorite tunes. I like listening to podcasts, stuff like that, so it's perfect for that, you know, just hearing the people speak and their vocals. But man, this thing is awesome. I got it on now. You probably can't hear it, but I, I, I even tried uh, in my other truck, I turned the AC off. And it, it, you know, it get 100, 100 degrees real quick. We've been above 100 degree weather uh, for a few weeks now. And this thing, I actually, uh, for about five minutes though, I turned the AC off in the car with the windows up and I was able to get to my destination, park and everything okay. If I did not have this on, I, I'd have been suffering. So this thing is nice. It's actually keeping me cool now. Like I say, I got an AI mode. You can manually put it in cool, and it heats also, so even in the, in the winter time. Cause I would think I was like, man, if I was in a survival situation, uh, you know, on those survival shows, when they ask what you want to bring, you know, like a striker, a pot, to boil water, man, I might take this AC fan with me. Like I say, cause it's good for all climates. Man, this thing nice though. But like I said, you can crank it down to the lowest setting on, on the AC if you wanted to. But I like to keep it in AI mode. Um, and, and I noticed too, when I like cut the grass and with the sombrero, the part of the sun beaming down on you, you put a sombrero on, keep that sun from beating around on you, you had like shade around your neck. Man, this thing awesome. I can't quit talking about it. Like I say, it's not sponsored anything. They ain't reached out to me. I want to try something because I, 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 I've been overheated before in, in the attic and I don't want to experience that again. So this right here, man, this is whoever invented this and came up with this, man, it's a lifesaver. I love this thing. But uh, we're going to test it out on this uh, next no cooling car. All right. All right, Ace back people. We got a no cooling car. Let's see if we can get a little footage, yeah? Yeah, that AC feel good around that neck. AC? Yes. All right. All right, so what's going on? I'm going to leave that open. Yeah. It might help the airflow. Yeah. Well, I got the AC around my neck, so it's... Oh, there you yeah. go. <laughs> All right, what you got here? I see your thermostat here. Yeah, that's where it's at. Mm -hmm. The unit is on that side of the house. Okay. So it might be easier if you got to come in and out. Mm -hmm. We can open the garage. You can mm -hmm. come through the garage. Okay, okay, yeah. So it's in the garage there. No, oh, the, the, the furnace and the air handler. Uh, I think that's in the attic right, right here. Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So I just want to pick up here first. Okay. And then, and then uh, you say your side gate is open? So I can yes, get they're open. Right? Okay, mm -hmm. That's all I need then. Yeah. And then I'll start from here. Okay. All right. When Do you it? need me to turn it on or? Uh, let me take a peek first and then okay. uh, turn it on. So what's going on? When it start happening? When you notice it stopped cooling? We started noticing it not last night, but the night before. Okay. So like at night, uh -huh. I usually leave it on like 70, 71. Okay. And we woke up yesterday morning kind of hot. Okay. And then my husband came home from work yesterday mm -hmm. at about noon. Okay. And it was like super, it was like 80 something in here. Okay. It's 83 in here now. Okay. Got a set for 72 fan. Okay. All right. 
to take a peek up here. Alright, folks, got a good one. Alright, we just hear the air finally kick on. Don't hear a condenser out there. Did hear the air handle kick on. Let's go take a look at the uh, condenser real quick. Hope this is cap and go. Well, we'll take take a look at the overall system, but we ain't got nothing going on out here. All right, so I do hear it trying to start. I do got 24 volts. All right, so yeah. Oh, uh, that's that death bug. They might be in luck. So first thing I'll do real quick is go ahead and kill this, disconnect. All right, so update on my fan, man. I feel real good. Hey, look, I do got a little shade right here, but if the sun beat down on me, I put a sunburrow on, but I feel good. I'm, I'm not rushing or anything like that. Because when you know you're getting hot, you get hot, you make mistakes and don't don't think clearly sometimes. Alright. There we go. So take a look at that. I'm gonna take a look at that capacitor. But uh let's see if we got a little pressure up in here first. From the looks of it, this looks like an R22 system. So, I don't want to waste a lot of time troubleshooting this electrical if the uh, system is flat. So, I just put this on here. As you can see, we got plenty of freon in the system, so I can bet, bet you it's this capacitor up here. All right, so I'm gonna check this capacitor. I'm gonna check the voltage first. As you can see, I haven't broke a sweat. Look at this AI technology keeping me cool. Like I say, this video is not in, endorsed by Renvo or, or the Air 3. All right. So I'm going to discharge this cap right here. We're going to check it. All right, so first one I want to check is the Hearn. We're going to check the fan and Should be a 40 by 5. Alright, so I'm gonna go here. Alright, let's check the pump over there. There we go. Alright, so I got 10. She'll have a uh, 45 there, but I'm only getting 10. I'm only getting 10, should have a 40 right there. So now I ain't even worried about checking the fan. I'm gonna go to my truck and we go get a uh, 40, 40 by five, 40 by five right here. It just changed out here. I'm trying to be very careful. No, 
other thing you have to be very careful not to touch it. The 24 volt, volt, volt circuit. very careful when you do change the capacitor because sometimes the terminals be a little smaller or bigger what I found is I had made the mistake and I think I came behind people that made the mistake of not making sure that they connections are tight and what happens is you come back about a week or so later get a call back it's not cooling again and you find a burnt wire that's going you know to the arm or the compressor I mean capacitor and uh, because of a loose connection. And you don't want to charge the customer, you know, coming back a month later because you didn't put a, you know, a tight connection on there and you're charging for a, a burnt wire. All right, so you really just want to make sure these are tight. So just give it a little, not close them, but a little snug on them. And we'll get a better fit connection on there. All right, folks. So homeowners, this is what you pay a little extra for your capacity. You have a qualified professional technician come out here and we look at things like that. All right. So that's nice and snug there. All right, that's my herm. Do the same thing. I can tell how loose it was. Snug it. See how loose that is? You don't want to be loose like that. That's too loose, it'll burn out. Condenser cord and get on capacitor, folks. All right. This update on the uh, Renvo. See, I haven't even broken a sweat. I'm gonna go get my temperature probe. I'm gonna let you know how hot it is out here. Pretty warm out here today. Around noon. See the 
temperature out here. Y'all see me sweat normally. I change the capacitor, y'all see me dripping down with sweat. So, like I say, I believe in good products, so I will be pushing some good products on this channel. A lot of y'all, y'all see I have quality tools. A lot of y'all been following me five, six years. So, I always keep good quality tools. You never see me with cheap stuff, so. You can see it's 95 degrees out here. I'm not sweating, so. I give this product thumbs up. You know what I'm saying? Y'all technicians or contractors out there looking for something to keep you cool. Like I say, y'all work. You can keep this thing around you all day. This is gonna be part of my wardrobe. Uh, like I say, I'm 94 degrees right here in the shade. I haven't broken sweat. Usually I be sweat down. So this thing keep my whole, whole body. Like I say, it come with an app. Like I say, I don't want to do a whole review. I was just doing a troubleshooting call on it. So if anybody just see this thing around my neck and wondering what it is, headphones like I say good dog play music and stuff like that you can use it as a headphone but mainly I use it for the AC around my neck but uh I'm gonna wrap this one up as y'all can see the pressure looking good but I'm gonna let it run for a while see if she want me to clean it up for her because uh, it does need a maintenance too but as always y'all thanks for watching that was no cooling call capacitor change out y'all stay safe out there get that walls in there Yeah.